friend. Hmm. I want to invite you into an auspicious celebration <laughs> of your womb wisdom. And this embodied poetry I want to extend to you this feeling of omnipotence and fertility and the magnitude of your potential to really feel that which is alive inside of your body, that which is alive inside of your womb, that makes you want to open your heart and hug the world and love it and feel your own self exposed and naked and held and taken and hugged and kissed and relished and licked and kissed, admired by something that is holding you, keeping you safe and leading you to trust that which is asking to be born through you. That which is asking to be born through your joy your devotion to standing, embodying, living your truth, for being in integrity with what you believe to be the most important thing in your life, beyond your ego, beyond your desires to get things out in the world or become something in the world or feel like you're liked or hmm, accepted or beautiful, or enough, or that you fit in. The kind of desire to contribute to the world, to share without an agenda, to birth, to really birth, to devote yourself to checking in with what it is that you feel to be most important and asking if that is true and asking how you can embody your values and how you choose to express your voice and how you choose to share whatever it is that you're doing with the world and how you choose to speak to someone and how you choose to Reveal the truth of your heart to someone. Being impeccable with your word. Being honest and in integrity and just very clean with communicating your truth. How you know it right now below your feelings, below your emotions, below your perceptions, the truth of what you know to be most sacred for you right now. So here is my invitation to you. And this is my prayer. The wetness of your heart will be your guide at the gate of your pleasure. When you step fully naked into the messy, golden path of your destiny, you will doubt, you will fight your truth, and you will fail over and over again. Your mind will shake. Your perceptions will crumble. You will be grateful for it all as you get up, bloody and free to witness yourself like never before, raw and empty, surrendered to knowing who you are. 
and you will keep going into the dark abyss of your shadow gifts. And you will know that you're not alone. And yet this path you will walk on your own. Trust the one you're with inside your heart, the seed of your soul, the root of your womb, the grace of your vision, the grail of your body, your wild, wise self. That one inside of you that moves like a jaguar in this body. The elk at the crown of your temple. The harlot, the mystical mermaid inside of your womb. That space where the one thing that you know is most sacred to you is being born. You might not know what it is yet. In fact, forget thinking about what it is. But your body is taking its shape releasing the karma, embracing a body free of your ideas about yourself from the past and knowing a freedom so deep it terrifies your mind. So will you trust this journey to birth yourself into the world? It's yours. It's messy, it's alive. <laughs> it needs you fully present. Your focus, your devotion. It's demanding your bravery to walk this path of no return back to yourself. It asks for your trust when you have nothing left to hide behind. When you have given it all up, you know it's time. Trust the process of incubating in the juices of your own yoni. And know that you must love the body that your soul chose to impregnate. <sighs> with this sacred gift of the message that you are here to deliver to yourself first. Will you do the work of revealing it to yourself today, of sitting with it, of asking it to show you the truth of what you are? so that you can bring it into the world? Will you create from it that which will honor your shadows and reveal your gifts without a hint of doubt? No arrogance no entitlement, no pride, no attachment, simply you birthing yourself into the world with every breath you take <sighs> and trusting that which moves your body forward to reveal whatever is yours to bring into shape and into form and into being as your sacred, simple, healing, 
gift. To this world. What do you see as the next step to your birthing? Keep dancing with it. Keep moving in it. Keep living it into existence with the joy of a child, with the trust of the wise woman that sits in the seat of your soul in the root of your heart, in the wisdom of your yoni womb self, here to reveal, to birth, to bring forth all parts of you, with nothing left but to taste your own essence in every moment of your life from this breath onward. So shall it be. Let's play. <laughs> To move beyond time. Now. <sighs> Feel yourself. Love yourself. Embody that one that is asking your permission. To be loved fully as you are. Now, so be. Be her. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for spending this time with me. Feel your own body right now. Feel yourself almost like elevated to a different vibration of fertility. And ask what is it that you must allow yourself to birth, to reveal, to witness in yourself. Feel your potential, feel your fertility, feel your devotion, feel your desire to be seen, to be witnessed, to reveal and receive your own love. You know the truth. May you honor your truth. Fully. Today. And may you witness the miracle that you reveal when you do. What is the truth you're waiting to reveal? And how does it need to be birthed in you, through you, right now? <sighs> Bless you. <laughs>